pretty good, sir. And it sounded good, you know, a month or two ago. Um, not so much right before we got ready to leave. Raptors guard Fred Van Vliet speaking to the media for the first time since the entire team flew to Florida last week in preparation to resume their season in the middle of a global pandemic. The team is now in a state where COVID-19 cases are dramatically increasing day by day. I understand it. You know, around the league, there have been some positive tests and they're trying to get ahead of that now. So once we were actually in the bubble, um, you know, hopefully that everything will be OK. Um, so I'm trying to be optimistic about it. It's not the most ideal situation, but it's kind of the times we're in. It hasn't been an ideal year for anybody. The players are near Fort Myers, Florida, preparing to resume the season in Orlando at the ESPN Complex in Disney World. Everybody is staying safe. You know, stay, stay put in your room and, and um, obey the rules. Um, and we go, we go to the gym uh, and do their, their practices uh, and, and come back. Um, that's, uh, that's, that's just the routine. The team members had to consider resuming the season in the risk of getting the virus, plus leaving their families for months, but also resuming the season when there is a social movement around the world against social and racial injustice. There's a chance to go use this as a as a good platform to show the world that really <laughs> Black Lives Matter and and we're trying to uh, we're trying to prove something here. If the league or, or more of my guys would have came together and said we didn't want to play, I would have sat out as well. I wouldn't have fought it. Um, but I think most of us decide to play, and and it's something that we'll have to live with. But I trust that my heart's in the right place, and and I'm doing enough um, to really make change. Just down the street from where the Toronto Raptors play at the Scotiabank Arena is where the Jays would normally play at the Rogers Centre. The team is in Dunedin, Florida at their practice facility where multiple players and personnel have tested positive for COVID-19. And it looks like the team is heading back to Canada. I know there's a few tweaks here at the province that Dr. Williams wants to work out with them, but we have to wait for the approval from the, the federal government on the quarantine side at the of things and if they can uh, move forward then uh, practice will start I believe they're going to be arriving July the 1st and kicking off uh, the practice uh, moving forward. Ontario Premier Doug Ford speaking on the Jays potentially returning to Toronto for training camp. The team is now waiting for official approval from the Canadian government but in the meantime a charter flight has reportedly been booked to bring the training staff and players back to Toronto on Wednesday. The Jays are planning to train on home turf and quarantine in the hotel attached to Rogers Centre. The move to Toronto was prompted by a COVID-19 outbreak at the team's Dunedin facility as well as the spike of COVID-19 cases throughout the U.S. The NHL announced this afternoon that 26 players have tested positive for the virus. As per the league's policy, the names and teams for these players have not been released. Lindsay Dunn, City News, Toronto.